I'm not creative. That's something I hear all the time. And I think we get really confused of what creativity is because uh, you're a human, so you're kind of creative. Creativity is making a movie, it's making a song, it's singing, it's dance. But it's not just that. Creativity is, is fantasizing, it's dreaming, it's imagining the world in ways that it could be. And if you do that, then I'm sorry to say, you're creative. Creativity is, is looking at a situation as it is and imagining it as it could be, even if that's a shoe rack or a way of sorting your clothes or getting creative on scheduling getting creative with your budget and figuring out how you can make this dollar stretch further or how you can reduce things and, and re-carve out a new path in your life. That's creativity. To be creative is simply to see things as they are and imagine them as they could be. And every one of you has that ability. But we often look at actors in Hollywood and say, that's creativity. We look at record labels and, and musical artists and say, that's creativity. And in truth, they might well be channeling that story great creative energy in a way that none of us really do. A very small fraction of people are going to tap into a certain type of energy, be it warrior, intellectualism. All these different energies can be heightened because we do need these stewards of energy because it inspires us. But our own creativity can't be conflated with theirs and the way they do it. Maybe that person, that artist that you think is the epitome of creativity is, but we're not trying to emulate that. We're trying to find our own connection with creativity. So give yourself a little bit of grace and accept that you are creative and start looking at the areas where you are applying creativity, even if it's daydreaming. Because for us to breathe fully and to feel balanced, we have to embrace first that we are creative.